Hello, and welcome to your bar sculpt class. Today is going to be fun, but harsh. There will be lots of holes and lots of pulses, so you will definitely feel this tomorrow in a good way. For today's workout, you're gonna need a set of weights and a prop to stabilize you for our bar series. It's gonna be quick and efficient, and you're gonna love it, I promise. So we're gonna get started with our warm up. Your feet are wider than hip width apart. You're gonna plie, extend your arms into a V, and bring it back down. Nice and big, stretch those arms away from you. Squeeze the bum at the top, tilt the pelvis forward, getting into the legs, and opening up your torso. Nice big breaths. Good, you've got five. Dig into those heels for four. Take it all in for three, two, and one. Changing our arms, you're gonna reach up, sit down, drop the head. Reach up, drop the head, swing your arms, make it nice and energized and vibrant. Warming up those legs still, gaining more breath. <sighs> Good for five, four, three, two, and one. Drop your arms beside you. Coming into knee up, reach your arms up, knee to chest, switch, legs. Good, think of it kind of like a crunch. You're drawing your hands into fist pumps. You're crunching those knees towards your heart. Point those toes, relax those shoulders. Good, we're warming up our heart now. Gaining a little more oomph, a little more heat for five, Four, three, two, and one. Moving into rainbows. You're gonna be on one side of your mat, rainbow your arms, come into a squat. Rainbow, squat. Good, quick, speed it up. This is your warm up. Good, keep the weight into the heels. Tapping one foot at a time. Big breaths for five, four, three, two, and one. Woo. Send your right leg away, engaging our obliques. Send your right arm away. Bend into that standing leg. Then start to crunch your right knee towards your right elbow, letting it be more so towards the side of your body rather than in front of your body. You got it. Stay with me. 15 seconds, other side. Then we get right into our arms for five. Four, if you need a chair, take a chair to help. For three, two, one. Other side. Left arm is away. Bend into your standing leg. Compress, extend. Getting those exhalations a little bit longer. Bringing that knee up towards the chest. You got it. Deep breaths, 20 seconds. Fast or slow, your choice. Good, for 11, eight, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Good job. Grabbing those lovely weights, you're gonna to come to one side. So stepping your right foot forward, your left foot is back, lift up that heel. 
Both your legs are straight. You're going to bring your arms up to shoulder height. Bend the elbows. Extend them forward and bring it down. Repeat. Up. Bend. Extend. Lower. Smooth transitions. Make it nice and stealth. You're letting those arms go straight and long. You're bending at the elbows to engage in a row. And then you bring it back. Deep breaths. A few more. Three, two, and one. Adding on. So you're gonna bend your knees, bring your elbows into cactus. Straighten your legs, bend your knees, straighten your arms. So it's a combo. Straighten, bend, arms up, return. Straighten, bend, arms up, return. Continue. You can bring your right knee as low as you'd like. Keeping your skeletal alignment stacked and safe. Elbows are bent to nine degrees and they stay there 10 seconds. We're going to drop that knee to the floor. In three, two, and one. Lower your knee, lower your arms. Untuck those back toes. Now bring your palms facing forward. You're going to come to a bicep curl halfway. Lower down, come up all the way. Good, come all the way down. Halfway, lower, all the way, down. Halfway, lower, all the way, down. Continue. If you want more intensity, you curl over those back toes and you hover that knee. Noticing where you are today. Giving your body exactly what it needs for five, four, three, two. First, hold. Hold it at nine degrees. Release the palm a little bit. Little pulses up. Good. Keeping your shoulders back. Contain the belly for five, four, three, two, one. Now out a little, in a little. Out a little, in a little. Keep going. You got it. For five, four, three, two. Hold it out, little out, little in. Little out, little in. Really burning out those biceps. Micro movements. Deep breaths. For 10. Eight. Six. Four. Two. And one. Elbows in. Lengthen your arms. Come into a sumo squat. So your toes are turned out, your heels are pulled forward. Let your knees display out. Good. You're going to come up a little bit so you're not so deep into the squat. And then you're going to come lower, elbows up. Up a little, down a little. Up a little, down a little. Continue. Bring those elbows high. Let that bum come low. We're going to pulse it in five, four, three, two, and one. Come down. Lift your heels up. Little pulses with your bum. Down and up for five. Lift those elbows high for four, three, two. And one, lower your heels, straighten your arms, straighten your legs, switch sides. 
Good, so now your right leg is in front and your left heel is lifted. This side is going to be different from the left side. So you're going to reach up, shoulder height, flip your palms, bicep curl, extend, flip your palms together, and lower down. Repeat, up, flip, bend, extend, flip, lower. Repeat, up, flip, bend, extend, flip, and lower. Continue. When we create these combinations, we're stimulating our physical body, but also our mental body. Making sure that brain stays optimized and doesn't come in too much for three, two, Finish off one more set for one. Let those arms come down. Good, now you're gonna bring both of your weights behind you, moving into your triceps. You're gonna bend your knees, extend your arms, extend the legs, bend the elbows. Repeat. Belly in, elongated spine. Your weights do not leave each other. Think of them like sisters. They want to stay connected. Creating nine degrees with your knees, but also your elbows. For five, four, three, two, one. Arms go up, knee drops down. And tuck your toes, lower your arms down. <sighs> Good. Now you're going to lunge deeply into that right knee. Your elbows sweep back and so do your arms. So you're going to bring them forward, parallel to the foot. Extend them back, straight arms. All the way forward. All the way back, hold it back there. Really letting those triceps be burned out. We've got five, four, three, two. Hold it back for one. Little bend, little extend. Keep going, tiny little pulses. Ten, nine, eight, seven. Lift it high. Six, five. Four, three, two, and one. Lower your weights. Maybe grab some water and then find your prop so that we can come to the bar. Coming into third position. Right foot intersects your left foot, just in the middle. And then left hand towards the bar, Right hand, let's start on our hip. Right toes point forward. You're gonna bend that standing leg. Come up, up, down, down. Up, up, down, down. So it's working in parts of two. Two pulses up, two pulses down. That lifted leg stays straight. That standing leg stays bent, keeping those joints nice and safe. You got it. Stay with me for five, four, three, two. Hold it in space. You're gonna flex the foot. Make sure your toes are turned out. Little out, little in. Little out, little in. Tiny little micro movements. If you want to challenge your balance, you can take your arms away from your body and the prop. Otherwise, it's completely cool staying with that support for three, two, one. Point your toes, little circles 
out. Tiny little circles about the size of a nickel. So, so tiny, so, so controlled for three, two, and one. Work it the other way. Don't give up little circles. Breathe. Use that breath for five, four, three, two, and one. Drop it down. Good. Coming into a curtsy. Your right foot is going to come behind. Both of your toes are turned out, keeping your hip flexors open. You're going to plie, extend that leg. Plie, extend the leg to the side. Making sure it doesn't go straight to the side. It's more so forward. Good. Stay with me. That structure of your upper body stays completely straight above that left leg. Good, your right arm can come to the side. We've got five, four, three, two, adding on. Two plies, two kicks. Two plies, two kicks. Continue. You got it. Nice and graceful. For five, four, three, two, and one. Drop the right arm, reach it overhead. Plie, elbow to knee. Plie, elbow to knee. Continue. One straight line from the crown of your head to your heel. We're not here for long. We're gonna pulse in that plie in five, four, three, two, and one. Come down, both arms up, little pulses. I told you there was gonna be lots of pulses. For five, four, three, two, one, stay. Hands on hips, heels rise, isometric hold. Be still. Be happy and be still. For three, get lower. For two, lift those heels higher. And for one, hold it. Now, let it go. Shake it out. Good. Move into the back side, hands towards that bar. Toes are turned out. Micro bend that same leg. You're gonna come up, up, down, down. Simple double pulse. As your body wants to tip forward, can you keep it in line still? Relatively in line still counts. Good, keep going for five, four, three, two, hold it up for one. Bend the knees, bring that leg back in, extend it out. Bend the knees, extend it out. Toes are turned out, chest is proud. Those right toes don't tap down. You got it. For five, four, three, two, and one. Keep that leg lifted, don't let it touch the ground. Pop away from your bar, forearms onto the bar. Let your left toes point forward. Your right leg is going to point back. Right hand on the bar, you're opening your hips to me. Lift up, and then bring that knee in. Lift up and bring that knee in. Option to add the arm. Inhale, exhale, crunch. Inhale, exhale, crunch. Keep going. Stay with me. Keep it nice and long when you reach it away. And then really squeeze it together for five, four, three. Two, and one, keep 
it back there, both forearms down. Bend the knee, straighten the leg. Bend the knee, straighten the leg. We're going to move into donkey kicks after this. Make sure your right toes are pointing down. Flat back for three, two, and one. Bend the knee, keep the foot flexed, pulse it up and up. Lift that knee, don't give up. For five, four, three, two, hold it up. Let that knee turn open, let it point down. Open knee, turn down. Keep going. Try not to lose the height of that knee when it opens up. For five, four, three, two, one. Keep it open, little pulses. Open. Tiny little pulses. Execute it for five, four, three, two, and one. Woo. Walk away from the bar. And slowly come up, letting us move into the other side. Left heel intersects. Hands on hips for now. Lift the chest up, point the toes forward. Up, up, down, down. Up, up, down, down. Coming back to that somewhat simplicity of just pulsing your leg up and down. Keep that standing leg bent. It always feels nice at the beginning of legs. You got it. For five. Four, three, two, and one. Let it, your leg be in space. Flex that foot. Little out, little in. Little out, little in. The more you turn out your foot, the more you feel your inner thigh begin to work. away from the midline. That inner thigh burn is serious. Good, for five, we're gonna switch the circle in four, three, two, and one. Switch it around, drawing it towards the midline. This is it. Belly in, tall spine. Five, four, three, Moving into that side, your left foot comes behind into a curtsy. You're going to plie and extend the leg. Plie and extend the leg. Toes are turned out. Knees are protected. Keeping your hips wide and open. Keeping your shoulders back and relaxed. Come back to that breath. That lovely, lovely, energizing breath for five, four, three, two, one. Double curtsy, double pulse. Double curtsy, double pulse. Keep going. Good. Making sure those knees. Don't cave in for three. We're gonna pulse it in two. Come into that curtsy, little pulses. Tiny little pulses up and down. Arms are forward, shoulders are relaxed. For five, four, three, two. Stay, lift those heels, both heels. Isometric hold, 
Get a little lower. Get a little lower. Even lower. Three, two, and one. Straighten your legs, relax your arms. Woo! Bringing that left arm up. Plie, contract. Plie, contract. Continue. Digging that right heel into the floor. You got it. Getting nice and low into that plie for five, four, three, two, one. Hold it down, both arms up. Widen your knees, little pulses out, 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 five, four, three, two, and one. Stand up. Holy moly. Shake out those legs, face your prop. You're going to turn out your toes, shoulders are back, lift up, up, down, down. Standing leg is bent. Deep breaths. We're almost done legs. Then we're coming into my favorite ab series. I call it Charlie's Angels. In five, four, three, two, one. Send that leg away, bring it to plie. Send it away, bring it to plie. Keep going. Keep those right toes soft. Keep those shoulders back for five, four, three, two, and one. Keep that leg up in space, hop away. Right forearm down, left hand on the bar, left foot away. Option to bring your hand behind your head. You're gonna lift, you're gonna bring it in. Lift and bring it in, continue. Strengthening our legs as well as our obliques. Deep breaths. You got it. Right toes are soft. Stay with me. So close for five, four, three, two, and one. Send that leg away. You're going to flip to face that bar. You're going to flex the foot, bend the knee, hamstring curls, flex and bend. Try to keep that knee as high as your hips. Dig into your right heel for five, four, three, two, one. Keep that knee bent, little pulses up, up, up. Squeeze that bum cheek. Stay with me. Keep breathing. Five, four, three, two, one. Stay, open it up, lower it down. Open it up, lower it down. This is your last pulse. We totally got this, right? For five, four, three, two. Stay here, little pulses. Up, 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 five, four, three, Two, one. Oh. Felt like my legs were gonna give out there. Fold, enjoy, breathe, let go. <sighs> Grab some water, a very tiny zip, because we're moving into core. You don't want to hold belly button. Coming onto your Fine, I'm gonna flip over. And we're moving into Charlie's Angels. So Charlie's Angels is basically a collaboration of abdominal strengtheners. And as we do it, I decide if we should do one round, two rounds, three rounds, or four. It's my favorite add-on to bar. We'll do one round and then we'll see how it works. So coming onto your spine, you're going to bring your 
Pinky, no. You're gonna bring your index fingers together and interlace your other ones. So you kind of have a pistol, like an angel. Charlie's angel. Extend your legs into a diagonal. You're gonna take it, inhale. Exhale, lift up, tiny little pulses. Tiny little pulses, lifting those shoulder blades off the ground. For five, four, three, two, one, hold it, bend the knees, bring your hands in between your legs, little pulses, up and up, press your feet together, let your knees widen, for five, four, three, two, one, legs are coming into a bicycle, arms are beside you, one knee to chest at a time, you've got it, let those legs go low, make it count, for five, Four, three, two, one. Feet on the ground, starts to tap those heels, stimulating those obliques, letting your torso swivel side to side. For five, four, three, two, one. Now flipping into a forearm plank. This is the end of your Charlie's Angel round. You have 20 seconds here. We are going to do a second round. Stay with me and then we'll be done. Promise. For five, four, three, two, and one. Come back onto your spine. Round two, right away. Getting into it. Legs are in diagonal. Find your pistol. Little pulses up and up. Breathe. This is it. This is the finale. For five, four, Three, two, one. Find your diamond little pulses through your legs. <sighs> Five, four, three, two, one. Bicycle, arms are beside you. Knee towards your nose. Make it strong. Elongate those legs for 10, eight, six, four, two, and one. Feet down. Tap those heels. Make it count. Make it big. Five, four, three, two, one. Pop onto your hands and your forearms. This is it. 30 seconds. Let's go. Bum, keep it low. Keep looking forward. 11 seconds. Strong breath. Push, push, push. Five, four, three, two, and one. Holy moly. That was probably my favorite bar class ever. Thank you for joining me. Hopefully you have a love-hate relationship after this workout. Make sure you drink lots of water. And please, please include some stretching or mobility after this. I linked a mobility that I suggest to do after this workout, just to make sure you have that balance. Can't wait to see you next time.